Hello everyone, Super Smash Saints in here, back from another Pick of the Day video, and like usual, I'll be covering two Pick of the Days. Uh, so yesterday, Sakurai basically said that by holding down the R button, uh, you can switch the music on the stages in the 3DS version. Uh, he also said that vocal tracks are not the best music for fighting games. I kind of agree, maybe, I don't really know, because I haven't given it much thought, to be honest. Uh, he also said that some stages have three variants, like the Punch-Out stage, which has the Final Destination version, the Super Smash Bros. version, and the Punch-Out version, or I guess the original. Uh, honestly, at first, I thought the Super Smash Bros. version was the Final Destination version, but that's not the case, and we knew this for quite a while. So I'm kind of curious to see what other stages have free variants. I can't think of any that would. Maybe it's just the Punch-Out stage for the 3DS version, but you never know. Uh, and today, Sakurai actually said that the Wii U version will have the color outlines for, like, team battles. And I'm really happy about that, because now you can choose whatever costume you want. And he also said the farther out the camera, like, when the camera zooms out, the bigger the outline will look. So that's actually really cool. That was, like, one of the main features I wanted, uh, one of the main features I wanted to be on the Wii U version from the 3DS. Uh, I'm still really curious to see what the exclusive Wii U mode is. I mean, I know we're probably going to have, like, masterpieces and special brawl, but I just want to see what that exclusive mode is. There is that Tower of Smash leak. I kind of believe it, kind of don't. I mean, it could be real. It did say a Game & Wario stage, so before and the leak came before the Game & Wario stage was revealed. So maybe it's true. I could definitely see it. Uh, but yeah, I'm Super Smash 77. I'll see you next one. Over and out.